Hi folks, this is Dandy Reiner at Hatch Finders Fly Shop in Livingston, Montana. I've been working on filling up the midge box for the fly shop. And uh, this right here is a pretty simple parachute midge. Uh, this is a size 20, tied on a Dairiki 310 hook. Not much to this fly, um, but the parachute is, uh, is what makes it special. It's high-vis, of course, with that bright pink EP fibers. And uh, I'll show you how I tie these. Put my hook in the vise. I'm using an uni thread, a dot black. Go ahead and do a thread base to the hook point. The body of this fly is moose fibers. And I usually take about three moose, moose hairs. And I tie them in at hook point with the points uh, facing down, tie them in at the, at the tips. And I'll run my thread up, snip off the excess. And I'll just go ahead and wrap these little fibers forward. It makes a nice segmented body. Tie that off behind the eye and trim away your tag ends. Yeah, it has a nice, nice segmentation to it. Next step is the EP fibers. We'll tie in that parachute, so you just want to take a small little strand of EP Tie it in a little bit behind the eye and parachute it. Come around your th with your thread and anchor it into place. So there's our parachute. Next step is the hackle. And I'm using a, a grizzly hackle. Tie that in and a very, very small little nothing of a smidgen of superfine dubbing in black. A very scant amount. And I'll come around the parachute and in front and behind. I always leave my thread to the left side of my parachute as I'm facing it. It's on my left. And then I start winding my hackle around the parachute two or three times. Now I pick up my thread and I come underneath all the fibers, underneath the hackle. I come around and I tighten it in. I come around the hackle behind the eye and secure it in. A few wraps behind the eye. Go ahead and do your half hitch or uh, whip finish it off. Trim your thread. Trim your parachute to the length you want it. You can do a short little parachute or a big tall parachute, whichever you prefer. Trim away your little your little flyaways here give it a little haircut it's a nice buggy looking midge this is a wonderful fly on the spring creeks south of Livingston here great wintertime fly on the river there's always a midge hatch happening
a great high-vis midge. So there it is. High-vis parachute midge.